in light of this meeting where Sharad Pawar and all the big guns, uh, uh, you know, Jayant Patil, I uh, accidentally identified him as the Home Minister, that's somebody else, sorry, Jayant Patil will be, uh, you know, going there uh, for this meeting with uh, Udhav Thakre. Uh, obviously, you know, the, the Shinde Sena, which is behind you in that hotel, Polomi, are keeping track of every single thing. They've got their own people in Mumbai who are telling them what's going on. Uh, you know, how will they see this? Is, 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 is each side playing for time right now? Because like you've been rightly saying, the more this stretches out, the more precarious it becomes. Shiv, it, it, it would be the case with anyone for that yeah. matter, you know, because they're here in unknown uh, territory, uh, you know, they're spending time locked up inside one hotel. Obviously, they have the entire hotel to themselves. They can move around. Security is extremely tight around the hotel, but then it's still one location and they, the, they've been inside over here. So they're soon going to run out of patience. Also, very importantly, Shiv, because of uh, two subsequent back-to-back -back, uh, bypolls that happened in Maharashtra, first the Rajas by elections, then the MLC election. Most of these MLAs, in fact, were out of their constituencies. They have been in Mumbai for a very, very long time before they were whisked away to Surat and from Surat to Guwahati. So they've been away from their constituencies for a long stretch of time. To go back to their constituents, how are they going to go back to their constituents and explain this absolute absence from their constituencies just because they were bargaining for power? Is that how they're going to explain? So clearly, if Eknath Shinde has to do something about the numbers that he's managed to garner and muster, he will have to do something very, very soon. But like Saurabh was pointing out, there is a long drawn out process as far as the disqualification um, notice is uh, concerned. And with 16 rebel MLAs getting that notice and likely that the deputy speaker, as per protocol, will call them, in fact, uh, to hear them out. There's a possibility of a video conference as well. But then again, it's a long drawn out process. If they're physically called, are they going to go to Mumbai because then mm. there's the threat that Eknath Shinde will fear uh, the fact that you know they could be broken and then of course uh, the ranks could be broken and if it's over video conference again the process is very very long so uh, this is going to be very interesting uh, you know going forward you know well. all eyes are going to be on that 6 30 p.m. meeting Sharad Pawar will be meeting Udhav Thakre for the second time in two days big meeting there will also be Jayant Patil there will be uh, you know Praful Patel and others who will be part of this meeting you know, the, the tantalizing question is, is it going to be more Baatcheet or will there be some decision, something to announce, either a resignation or revealing that they've got more numbers, more than just the usual, you know, claim versus counterclaim war that has taken place so far. Because remember, only the Shinde Sena has now demonstrated that it has the numbers and Aditya Thakare, very importantly, has candidly admitted in front of Shiv Senek just about 20 minutes ago that the... Udhav Sena, as it were, does not have the numbers. Is that a concession of impending defeat? Or could there be some aces up the sleeves of both Udhav and Pavar? Are the questions that need to be asked. Here's what Udhav Thakre, the man who stands to lose the most right now, here's what he said as he addressed Shiv Seniks and district leaders just under an hour ago on Zoom. Take a look at this. परवा भी बोललो आणि मी वर्षा सोडलं आणि माझ्या मातोश्री मध्ये आलो काही जणांचे मला फोन आले आज येत आहेत की उद्धवजी तुम्ही वर्षा सोडायला नाही पाहिजे होत म्हटलं का नाही लोकांना असं वाटतं तुम्ही जिद्द सोडली म्हटलं मी जिद्द सोडणाऱ्यातला नाहीये मी मोह सोडला पण जिद्द नाही सोडणार मी कधी आणि ज्या गोष्टी आपल्या नाहीतच त्या सोडायचा मोह हा असू नये का महत्वाकांक्षा जरूर असावी पण तिला ती राक्षसी महत्वाकांक्षा असता का मारे की ज्यांनी दिलं त्यालाच खायचं ही महत्वाकांक्षा नाहीये ही महत्वाकांक्षा असू शकत नाही आणि जास्तीत जास्त काय केलं तो आज तुम्ही आमदार नेल्यान घेऊन गेला घेऊन जा आणखीन गोळ्याला घेऊन जायचं घेऊन जा तुम्ही झाडाची फुलं तोडू शकता झाडाची फळं तोडू शकता पण झाडाची मुळं ही उपटून काढू शकलेल्या नाहीत